Astronaut and GmbH is a space startup company. It's the a women-owned and led space startup company, and it's the only startup company in Europe um, that has experience with human spaceflight. The status of our pilot project, first female German astronaut, is um, we're making good progress. We're on time. We're in the middle of the training. We have an agreement and uh, we had a lot of talks with American companies, with a commercial provider for access to ISS and we have a slot reserved uh, by the end of 2020 and we're doing everything to make sure that we can keep that slot. Our two astronauts are doing very, very well. I have more than 40 years experience in spaceflight, 20 years in training astronauts. I've trained more than 75 astronauts and cosmonauts from more than 10 countries. We are now in the final stage of the basic training and they are doing very well. We are close to successfully finalizing this and then we are ready for the next phase of the training, which will be the mission specific training, which will be starting as soon as we have a dedicated mission booked. So we've just finished up our diving training and the objective of this training was to simulate reduced gravity as one would find, for example, on the moon. We're currently in the so-called basic training where the general skills uh, are learned. So we've now done parabolic flights where we got to experience microgravity. Uh, we've done this diving training and we've also obtained our pilot's license. So one of the main things is really acquiring a certain way of thinking to be very systematic, to follow a checklist, to not make mistakes, even in stressful situations. And this will be followed by a more mission-specific training where we're really going to learn which experiments we're going to do and so on. What's special about our training at the moment is also that we're putting a large focus on the teamwork part. So we're working on um, Zuzana and me establishing um, a communication that we can also use when one of us will be on the space station and the other is on the ground so that we know the same terminology. We have our astronaut trainer um, who's working with us on that and we use the trainings on Earth um, where we are together to actually establish this and lay the groundwork. 50 years on the moon and the very large um, attention being brought to this event by the German media also is wonderful for us to see because it shows how much of the focus is now also going on astronauts in space and that's part of what we do. We are here at COMEX in Marseille, southern France. Uh, COMEX is specialized in the development of technologies for uh, human intervention in extreme environments like diving activities or also space. Actually, we are searching for links between the maritime sector and the space sector, so technologies that are coming from the maritime sector that can be used in the space sector or the other way around. NASA just announced that they will open low Earth orbit for commercial space flights, for private space flights. So now is the time for the first female German astronaut. Now is the time for astronaut in GmbH to commercialize um, low Earth orbit for Europe, for Germany. We're working hard to ensure the financing of the project, which is still the most difficult part. But we're talking to politicians and we're talking to sponsors and we're very confident that we will manage to bring the first German woman into space by 2020.